everyone, this is Princess Beltran and today I will be discussing the philosophical thoughts of education but I will only focus on John Locke and Herbert Spencer. So, John Locke. John Locke was an English philosopher and physician regarded as one of the most influential Enlightenment thinkers and known as the father of classical liberalism. He was born on August 29, 1632 and died at October 28, 1704 at the age of 72 at England. He studied at Westminster School, Christchurch, and Oxford University. John Locke was one of the most influential people in England and perhaps one of the most influential people in 17th century. John Locke was known as the Empress Educator. When we say empiricism, it means knowledge of the world is based on one's experience. So John Locke's philosophical beliefs state that your knowledge or knowledge of the world is based on one's observation and perception. Without experience, knowledge is impossible. He believed that child was born on tabula rosa or blank slate. It means what you have known at what you are right now is merely cost of your experiences. Herbert Spencer was an English philosopher and prolific writer. He was one of the leading social Darwinists of the 19th century. Spencer was one of the most argumentative and most discussed English thinkers of the Victorian era. He was born on April 27, 1980 at Turbay, England and died on December 8, 1903 at the age of 83 at Brighton, England. He was educated at home in mathematics, natural science, history and English, among some other languages. Herbert Spencer's philosophical thought of education is utilitarian. Utilitarianism is a form of consequentialism which advocates that those actions are right which bring about the best of overall. Spencer's concept of the survival of the fetus means that a human development undergoes through an evolutionary series of stages from simple to complex and from uniform to the more specialist kind of activity. He believed that the only way to gain knowledge is through scientific approach. For him, only through scientific knowledge, people were learned to live in this society. So that's all for today. Thank you and have a blessed day.